Hey guys, the gods of Opera have gifted us again with a new thing, which is the newest update on Game Maker Studio. And what I mean by that, well, that thing here. So basically, we're getting the newest version for January. Therefore, they just say like, hey, this is how we do it. So the year plus dot the year, uh, the month. So this is for January and then two for February. So I guess. Uh, every month we will get a new update, maybe, maybe, I don't know, I have no <laughs> influence on that or any specific information. And then what we're gonna have is basically, first of all, two pretty cool new features. Uh, basically we are having three. The third one I'm just gonna skip because it's completely useless in my opinion. Oh, I, for me it's not that in interesting. So the single layer filter effect, which is pretty sweet, I'm gonna show you that. Then inspector, yeah, I'm gonna skip on this dude here. And then the new collision system, which can cause some issues, but it's uh, refined, it's better. It's now with float numbers. Before it was just rounded down to integers. And therefore it could have some issues or it can have with your older projects issues. Therefore. I'm going to show you how to activate and maybe remedy that so you're still in the safe zone. And then we got the code name Feather Better Only thing, uh, which is pretty sweet. So I actually love the, this feature a lot. I'm going to show you that in a few seconds. So first of all, let's go into our single layer effect. So that is basically what you're seeing on the screen. I just have a well, effect layer just set specifically just for one layer so basically everything which is on well this is my default instances layers so where i have my enemies and my dude and then only that before um, the default is that for example you have one fx layer and everything below is being affected also but here you can just say like no 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 please only have an effect or the fx thingy here so basically the <laughs> easy Wow, oh, he's clipping, he's clipping quite a lot through that stuff. Um, so basically you just have one um, FX being uh, well on the spot on basically just one layer. So how does that look like? Kind of easy. So if you updated it to the newest runtime, let's go, uh, for example, uh, here, you just grab the FX layer which you want to use. So for, for example, for me, this would be the distort. And as you can see now, everything is distorted. We don't want that. So I just say like, hey, yeah, let's use this FX, which of course needs to be in the room. Set it to a single layer and then apply it to the layer which you want to use it. Then my instances, so this dude here, and then boom, everything which normally uh, <laughs> is on well on this specific instances layer so my player and the robot dude are just affected so once again this is then for a single point which i love so this is a great addition then the next thing because now collisions could be a little bit wonky before that they were uh well just integers so basically rounded down and therefore now we have float numbers or so like well, 16.655 or whatever therefore maybe you got some issues concerning collisions so if you want to be on the old side concerning um, your for example because stuff is breaking or not working correctly you just go under game options and then you just go on the general and then you have collision can i make it bigger yes collision compatibility mode and therefore um, you can enable or disable it on the fly if you like and let's go now into the code name the special case this thingy here the greatest thing since the slice bread which is then in our beta this is the feather system so for example if i hover over or for example if i uh, let's see as you can see you have this nice little feather system normally this would be just an autocomplete which is of course very useful but this is kind of a advanced version of that which you have which you for example if you are a developer uh, other uh, well, systems already have that. For example, I just hover over that and like, <gasps> ooh, nice little stuff. So as you can see, I'm just hovering over that. Well, uh, SPR something something, and then it's just showing me more information, which is pretty cool. So for sometimes um, you just have um, what? Don't don't tell me. Um, um, sometimes you want to know what actually that means. So basically, uh, you're just not sure, and then. Um, here you will get for example more information so of course everything is listed on this new on their newest uh, release 
a blog post so if you want to read up so basically once again single layer effects then the inspector yeah i'm gonna completely skip on you and then collision system changes which could have issues if not everything is pretty fine so once again new good stuff and of course this is then more robust for the future and of course our code name feather <laughs> system which is giving you more information and doing some auto completions and of course it is an improved way and it does some code completion for you which is pretty solid so this is a very good thing and will be uh, very handy for uh, game maker studio so once again i applaud for the new good stuff i love it and therefore uh, let's have that in uh, hopefully a very short time so hopefully you uh, enjoyed this and you will download it and then hopefully everything works for you and now you can uh, enable for example the singer layer effect which is pretty sweet so this is a very good thing now if they for example can do that on a single object then we basically completed everything which we need for this uh, dummy or extremely easy to use uh, well shader because th that's what it is and as you can see now here uh, no, 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 please don't jump then for example this would be on the whole screen but of course you can just have it for one specific layer which is a godsend which i definitely love Alrighty, that was it from my side have a good one and thank you once again to the oprah gods for this new update uh, one up indie